All right, Launchville, Launchville family, welcome back, welcome back. Anyone else who is not a Launchville family, you know, welcome as well. Because again, my builds are my builds, anyways. I'm gonna, I was gonna do them regardless as to why. I was gonna do them regardless, uh, but I'm putting it on camera. I'm taking the time to grab the footage and put it out there for you guys who have ideas, questions, and you know, just theories. You know, because I'm a theory guy myself, and I love putting theories to the test. So that is what launch build is about. And as you, you get to this, again, it kind of is the world's first on the internet. Uh, full breakdown from beginning to end. Running. <laughs> Test drives. Assembly. I'm the one that's on the internet, the only one with a B6 A4 on top of that. And I would like to again thank the sponsors SPA Turbo, Mishimoto, uh, Bradenton Performance Supply, um, Wolfpack Tuning. I got a list now, guys. I got a list now. Um, our new sponsor, BAT. British American Transfer. Uh, they have all kinds of fittings, oil coolers, um, AN lines, like the whole nine yards, guys. Like, if I did forget any sponsors, I'm sorry. You already paid, so you're in there. Rick is assembling a motor for me on the back. It's taking care of some things. So again, uh, shout out to all the sponsors, but let's get you to this content and again, this launch build. So, start turbo. <laughs> box of pipes the transition adapter this quick spool valve and this is just an adapter from the t3 manifold to a t4 uh, valve all right damn that's a perfect transition almost nice all right so Got my pieces, angles, my straight cuts. I got my turbo flange. Some more straight cuts. Each of them, you know, higher, shorter than the last, whatever. Some more bends. Downpipe flange, bolts. Everything we need to, well, most of what we need to get this going. Let's. Let's get it going. Um, you said the taller one. Taller one. Alright. And I'm going to. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I like that. We'll see what we can do. I like that. Let's make it work. Let's make it work. Yeah, I almost touched that. I'm not doing that. Kind of got to get them. Now that you've purchased or received your parts and you've put them together, you're going to get something that looks like this. Or if you're a professional fabricator, which I am not, you'll get something that looks like this in the end. So, I got you, huh? Finished product, then you're gonna head over to your vehicle. And you're gonna test fit it, yada, yada, yada. But 
Then you have this right here. So now, boom, the SPA twin scroll manifold is now used for a twin turbo setup. Like, how easy was that? How easy is that? All you had to do was make a custom flange and some piping and get it on there. So now, how I have mine set up to keep it pretty much as bolt on as possible because I, I like to show you guys my, what is it, complex? Complexity, like, I don't know, I got a weird complex issue. Like, I like complication. So I wanted to keep everything bolt on. So the stock wastegate and everything should still fit under the hood. Um, these twins here. So again, depending on how you have your setup, if you're a drag car or if you're a hoodless, as I used to be, you can set your turbos high, however, whatever, but I set mine so that I could still close the hood and still hide the twin turbos uh, so I can be a nice little sleeper. All right, so let's get these turbos and let's go bolt this stuff up. I ain't gonna lie, these little turbos are just heavy though, for real. <laughs> I know, I was surprised when I picked them up. So we got everything laid out for us. Look at this canvas. Look at look at this canvas, guys. The bolt on. Easy bolt on. So again, the manifold that I am using is the SPA Turbos Twin Scroll uh, manifold for the 1.8T. At the moment, I know it's been going crazy hot on sales, and after this, I'm sure it's going to be damn near impossible to get. So SPA Turbo, watching. Send me another one, please, so I can do this again. But we're gonna get this going for you guys, and let's put these turbos on. Launch build, launch build. So now I got everything plumbed up, plumbed up. Boost lines going, got a little temporary drain going, setting up, but we ready to activate some boost. So let's get to making some sounds. Let's get it. in less than a month it came to my mind had the vision had the parts i said let's get it let's make some noise I think that was it too. 